What's up guys? We are out here cutting. I'm out here cutting. everybody doing today it is a beautiful monday morning and i am just out here knocking them out so today i wanted to talk about something that came in the mail last week it was the darwin strip man you may be able to see it back there on the trimmer rack maybe maybe not so it's on my echo 2620t um, i've been using it for a couple of days i kind of have mixed feelings about it but today we're going to take a an in close look at it and uh, see what it's all about. So, a couple of things that I have noticed is I do stand up a lot straighter while using it. And there's a couple of things I'm kind of wary about, the, like uh, edging and stuff like that. It takes some getting used to. Um, and I still I haven't really been messing with it as far as where I, where I like the position to be. Uh, but I think I'm gonna mess with that. I've watched several other videos. Uh, there's actually quite a few reviews out there of the Darwin script. And um, one of the guys I was watching, he said twist it a little because it makes it easier to grip. Now I'm curious if that gets it out of the way for when you're edging as well. Um, another guy I was watching, he said uh, to leave part of it, to leave a piece loose that way you kind of you can um, move it how you want to and it moves with you and it's more comfortable for him that way and that's how I have it right now so we're gonna be getting over here to another yard real shortly and I will give you an introduction of the Darwin script so stay tuned guys
I just had a big surprise. I was cutting the yard, the lady came out, handed me a check, finished mowing, started trimming, and the husband came out, and uh, he's got some sight problems. He can't see very well, so he had a, a walking stick, and he was uh, walking over towards me. So I stopped trimming, and I said, I said, hello, sir, how are you? And I'd, I'd not met him yet, but he, he reached out, and he handed me a $20 bill. I said, oh, just what? He, he handed me a look just like a you know couple of folded bills and I said oh no she already paid me and he said well this is this is on top of it you go out of your way to to do an extremely good job at our house I said, well, that's my job to you know that's that's the quality that I like to provide you know is a is a job well done you know I take pride in my work and he said well you are deserving of this. He handed me a $20 bill. So I, I thanked him and he turned around and started walking away. He said, hey, if there's anything y'all need, just give me a holler. So, very nice man. Um, first time meeting him. And uh, it's, it's customers like that that, you know, make me smile. I'm not, I know I have, some of y'all are watching. I'm not saying you need to tip me or nothing like that you know I bill everything into my price so um, you don't have to you don't have to tip me uh, it's, it's part of my job it's in my price so but it's you know just especially in a time like this you know to, to put a smile on your face so, looks like a colt coming along over there or a very close condominiums all right guys we're out on this property here it's a rental for a buddy of mine i've already got the grass cut so there's a big ditch runs along the road all the way up the property and i figured that'd be a good time to put this darwin's grip to use so Right now I've got it to where it's kind of free moving, um, especially for doing this ditch, because uh, I don't want to be stuck in one position and it not be comfortable. So I want to be able to move it. I like how it has the ability to swivel like that. I don't think that's what it was intentionally for, but I know once you get it into position, uh, sometimes depending on what you're dealing with, uh, ditches, hills, stuff like that. Sometimes it is a little bit more comfortable when you're able to, to have that bit of movement right here. So I'm gonna set y'all up here in a second and we're gonna get down in this ditch and see what she's got.
Well, there you have it. We knocked out the ditch. I could definitely tell a little bit more strain on my forearms, but I'm also, you know, in a different position. So I feel, you know, as using that, it was pretty simple to do that. Um, but I feel that, you know, with the, using it a little bit more, you're gonna, you're already straightening your back up. Um, Y'all saw my posture was decent compared to uh, just using the regular handle that comes on it. So that was a big plus. So I'd say that's pretty much just having to adjust to the to the new grip. Uh, you're holding it at a different position now, so it's going to be a little different, and you're probably going to work muscles that you haven't worked while trimming. Now, I kind of noticed the first time that I tried to use the Darwin's grip, the first yard I put it on, uh, I pretty much felt like I was teaching myself how to weed eat again. All these cars going by. Um, but I felt like I was pretty much having to teach myself how to weed eat again. Um, it was different. You were holding it the way that you were holding it, standing straight up. You know, it was, it was different. So um, after a couple of yards, I felt good enough to where I could you know, use it and be comfortable with it. And it was all in the adjustment to it. So, so far, I like it. But we'll see. Well guys, we are done for the day. I ended up finishing up everything that I had to do. Um, the reason I didn't record a lot more than I did of the Darwin script is because we had chances of rain. And as you can see, there's sprinklets. I could have got out and hit another one, but I didn't need to. I finished everything I needed to do. So, um, short day tomorrow. Not too much going on. Um, got a couple of yards to do. Uh, one, I do have to trim the whole yard. Uh, you can't put a mower on it. You can put a push mower on it, but uh, it's quicker just to trim it. So we will really get a test in and hopefully if it's not raining tomorrow, which I think we have like a 40% chance or something like that the last time I looked. So it could be zero or a hundred by now. Um, but if we are, I am gonna get some more footage. So this is not the conclusion of the Darwin's grip, but it's enough to make a video. Well, watch out. So we are gonna conclude this video though. If you haven't already, please hit that like button. Subscribe if you want to see more content from me. Uh, I do plan on doing some more. So, that being said, y'all had a great day. I hope y'all had a great day. And uh, catch you in the next one. The music starts now. A little bit of a build up. Uh oh. Perfect. Uh oh. Perfect. Peace. Perfect.